My name is Grace Connard and I'm from the Academy for Science and Design in Nashua, New Hampshire. I love to get out and see the world and I'm not afraid of new experiences. I challenge myself to be adventurous, trying a giant Ecuadorian Grumpy, searching for the world's most thrilling roller coaster, tubing, zip lining, you name it. But when not out on a big adventure, I love to find the fun in life's little moments. I sing and dance to no end, even without lyrics or any pre-planned choreography. I enjoy patterned socks, overly competitive games, and weekend trips to the flea market. My second home is the golf course. When I was little, my parents used to tee up my ball 30 yards from the green. Now on the varsity team, I'm placing top 10 in state tournaments. Golf has been a journey I hope to continue for the rest of my life. Another notable activity of mine has been theater. From my first performance at age five to the 20 or so performances that came after that, theater has hugely benefited my self-confidence. I also compete in poetry and speech competitions, using my education and communication skills to present meaningful arguments on relevant social issues. At school and in my free time, I love learning, experimenting, and taking on new projects. I'm the girl who wore her own 3D printed glasses to middle school, who made robotic dragon wings in a Galilean pendulum okay. clock from just Legos and toothpicks, who writes 30 page science lab reports, who performs statistical analyses on student grades during COVID, who used microcontrollers to automate chores on the International Space Station, and whose latest project is using algorithmic composition to revolutionize piano practice. As you can probably tell, I have a broad range of interests, but one thing is for certain. I'm passionate about technology. I love how fast it develops, and I'm fascinated with its ever-evolving applications to solve the world's most important problems. I'm excited to use Brown's Open Curriculum to not only further my computer science education, but also to explore the sectors to which I may one day apply technology to create real, high-level, positive change.